Now, what are you doing today for us? So today, something really light and summery. I'm doing my minty lamb barbecue skewers. Lovely. Doesn't take much time at all. Absolute doddle, so you can get out and enjoy the sun. Good. Hopefully, where yes. you are. Uh, so to start these off, I've just got some really nice quality uh, lean lamb steak here, just uh, diced up. Want to keep it quite um, quite big chunks. I quite like my lamb pink in mm -hmm. the middle. Okay. If you go too small, it can dry out quite easily. So just keep them keep them nice and uh, nice big chunks. Uh, and then we're going to put a simple marinade on that. So not very many ingredients in this. Uh, we've got about four tablespoons of natural yogurt. Okay. Go in there. Uh, I've got one clove of garlic, which I'm going to crush in. And this is this is simple. You can do this really easily, yeah? Yeah, you can do this really easily. And the best Ooh. thing about this is you can do it kind of ahead of time uh, right. because ideally I'd want to leave this for at least an hour for the um, the marinade to really do its work. Sure. Uh, but I quite like leaving it overnight because as well as flavouring the meat, it will tenderise the meat as well. Ah, of course. So just uh, the zest of a lemon in there. I've got some that I zested already. I'm just going to half okay. this and pop some of that juice in as well. Could you do this with chicken? Would it work? You could do it with yeah. chicken. I, I really like, like this because lamb. chicken is easier to dry out, but you um, could do it with anything okay. anything you had in the house, really. Uh, so juice of lemon in there, and then I've just got some freshly chopped mint as well. Lovely. So mint and yogurt, really class, um, kind of Greek combination. Yeah. And then just give that a little bit of a stir with a little olive oil as well. And just a pinch of salt and pepper. And as you say, if you can leave it overnight, then great. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, I find with barbecues, it's often really nice to do everything ahead of time yeah. so that you're not kind of fretting around the barbecue when your friends arrive. Very true. That's good. So give that a mix. Uh, and then what I do is I keep that in the fridge for about an hour or overnight. Mm -hmm. uh, and I've got one that I've marinated already here. You can see it's just tenderized beautifully.